All right, here's an update as well. Previously on The Walking, on the Walking Dead. Dead. Shut up, Carly. Ugh, I've heard enough out of you. Now, what the fuck's the problem? That was crazy. I can't believe we relived that moment. It was also not at night. It was in. It was literally not at night when she did that. It was broad daylight, I think. Sure, the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. But y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do we do? Give me the gun, kid. I'll do it. Yeah, I popped him off, dude. I popped I Duck. Think we should look for like it was like I was destined really? to pop Duck. Yeah, you need to know if they're okay, and well, if they're not, what happened to them? I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? It's all my fault. I fucking we called it too. I knew what? that that was gonna happen. No way! Ah! Shit! Can't wait for you to get to Savannah, Clementine. I got your parents right here. And you be sure to find me whether Lee wants you to or not. Now, what I need. How does he know who fuck? Lee is? I don't know. But I doubt we're gonna be happy when we find out. Bro's a pedophile, dude. How are you going to be a pedophile in the zombie apocalypse? You know what I mean? That's a dude. That's a dude that honestly, you know, that's you throw that dude to the zombies. I've been talking a whole big game about no capital punishment this day on this day. And I've been literally capping motherfuckers left and right. It's kind of fucked up that Clementine has been hogging in this random weirdo. But at least we're now officially in Savannah, Georgia. That's right, baby. Yo, my fucking Persian short king is not going to make it out. I feel like I do like him, but honestly, he is a little bit of a dead weight on it, So we might have to cap him. Can't I just hold it? Just for a little while. We're getting real close to where my mom and dad are. Maybe I can... Not now, Clementine. Maybe later, okay? Okay. She's such also a cutie me. pie. I can't, I can't do bad. this. I can't I'm be fine. mad at her. You're not fine. You need to rest. He needs to rest. Kenny, how much farther to the riverfront? There should be just a few more blocks up ahead. And there'll be boats there? There sure as hell better be. There'll be boats. Have to be. Have to be. It's going to be okay. Kenny knows what he's doing. Shut what up, Ben. Hell? You fucking bitch. Yeah, God don't stop, baby. Maybe That's right. The city's not so dead after all. Keep moving. No one's ringing that bell. It's automatic. On a timer. What kind of church bell goes off at 20 past the hour? Someone's up there. Are you sure? I don't see anything. Hey! Hey, you up there! Damn it, Lee. Keep quiet. You're gonna... If I were you, I'd get out of the street now. I thought you said that thing didn't work. Who the hell is this? Hello? Hello? I said answer me. Clementine now knows that I know that the walkie talkie works. What the hell was that? Is someone trying to fuck with us? Sounded more like a warning. Yeah, he called the zombers. The bell tolls. What are you yammering on about? It, he called the zombers. Come on, bro. Be be fucking be for real, Kenny. It tolls for thee. Obviously, no shit. The fucking bell is gonna bring about. A shit ton of zombies our way. Duh. Everybody, run! Why would oh shit, oh fuck? Wait, how can he run if his legs, he's got a bum knee? Oh, 
Okay, Chuck. Chuck is pulling his weight, bro. Kitty! Dude, that's easy. Too One close. frame. Don't you think? Ben! One frame, baby. No, Ben! Help oh, God, Ben, you suck ass, bro. Oh! Oh! God oh, damn it! Kitty, Ben! What is this? Wait, what the fuck? Why is it not helping? No! Wait, I shot those things, bro. What? Oh, that's for the cutscene. Okay. Get her the hell out of here. I'll catch up with you. It's for the lore, because I, I popped those motherfuckers 100%. I don't miss in this game, bro. I don't miss in this game. Move I'm your fucking, asses! I'm River Street's right up ahead! That's not all. I'm basically the Turkish Tadak. They they had to do that. They had to do that for the game. The game was like, oh, bro, come on. You're too good. Like, we got to get Chuck the fucking... Clap some of these zombies, you know what I mean? Literally, Turkish Tadak. That's what they all say around these parts. Turkish Tadak. Oh, give me a fucking break! Wait, where the hell's Chuck? <laughs> Shit, he's in trouble. We gotta help him. <laughs> There's no time. We gotta go now. I'll be fine. Just go! Fuck no, bro. Come on. What? They didn't even give me a decision? I would have saved Chuck's ass. I would have saved him. We need a musical guest. He was a musician. He's a vibe deliverer, dude. That's crazy. We just locked okay? the door behind us. Uh, yeah. You've opened up your wound. You're bleeding. Charles Shit, Entertainment Cheese, bro. We've got to get him inside. Clean him up. Kenny, how's that door coming? I'm working on it. I'm working on it. We'll work faster, would you? Won't be long before those things outside figure out where we went. You know they can smell blood. Let me see if I can find us a way in. Yeah, I'll take matters into my own hands. You already know what it is, baby. Let me talk to Omen and Krista, though. How's he looking? I'm all right. You're not all right. You've reopened your wound. You're losing blood. He is our Brooke, yes, except he's there. better than Brooke. It could be infected. It could be... No offense, but you really need to work on your bedside manner. She's just worried about you, man. Don't worry. We're gonna get you fixed up in no time. Just as soon as we're inside, okay? Why is he looking okay. at me like that? Thanks, man. Please he's just a Persian boy. We need to get him inside now. I'm on it. Just sit he's tight. just a Persian boy hey, who loves the Civil War. Anywhere. He li literally is looking at me. Why is he looking at me with that ri with them Riz eyes, bro? Looks like something was buried here. The dog, bro. What do you mean? Just a dog house. Just a dog house. That's what you're in. That's what Clem's in. Clem's in the dog house. Let's be real. No, no. Fountain. Not thirsty enough to drink that yet. That's just how Persians look. The shovel is never not useful. Dude. <laughs> Why would a dog have a cross, man? It's a fucking church dog. Fuck you mean. Open house door. No yeah. We're going to force that open. Not without making a lot of noise, at least. What's this? Looks like there's some kind of pet door here. Yeah, bro, I'm telling you, that's a that that is a I dog. Tried it already. That's locked too. Who the hell ever heard of a locked doggy door? I have. My neighbor had one just like that. It's it's radio controlled. The dog wears a collar with a chip in it, so the door only opens when the dog gets close to it. Oh, I'm I'm Bullshit. digging the dog out. Every day's a school day. I'm digging the dog out. All right, so Chatters where's Chatters who said that's not a dog. Why would a dog have a cross? Uh, you're about to look really silly, okay? Because, yeah, all dogs go to heaven, even Christian dogs, okay? The dog. I will be digging up the dog, though, for sure. Uh, hold on. Let me talk to this fucking dipshit. And then I'll talk to Clem. About what happened back there on the street. I know. I don't know what happened. I just froze up. Hasn't that ever happened to you? Just hear what I'm saying to you. You put that girl in danger again. It won't be walkers you have to worry about. Yeah. I hear you. 
fucking kill think you. Think we can get in through one of these windows? Man, I don't think so. Whoever owned this place had them all barred up. Yeah, looks pretty solid. Yeah, I didn't see you fucking freezing up when you chose to run away, you fucking bitch. How do you think Kenny's holding up? I don't know. It's it's like all he can think about is finding a boat. He definitely doesn't want to talk about Katja and Duck, at least not with me. Maybe we should just let him deal with it in his own way. I'm going to go check things out. Wait, right. I could have made him courageous? Do you think the dead people saw us come back here? Are they going to find us? No, they didn't see us. We were too fast for them. I can still hear them out there. <laughs> it sounds like they're getting closer. It's just your imagination. I'll feel safer when we're inside the house. Yeah. Will you feel safe enough to call up some random pedophile, Clementine? I didn't forget about that, but we're not going to think about hey, that for now. Be careful. Digging up dead things isn't what it used to be, you know what I mean? Yeah, I hear you. Clementine, don't look at this. What's buried down there? Dead dog. With a collar. Nothing. Clem, go over and sit with Krista and Omi, okay? But I want to... Just do what I say, okay? Clementine feels hurt. Come on, man. You don't want to see a dead pupper. as nasty as hell. Oh, That's like... Oh, God, the smell. Literally worse than seeing dead humans. Must have belonged to someone. Dude, I'm doing grave robbing. I can't get it off. Okay, Ooh. that is not cool. Are you oh, okay? shit. I'm fine, honey. It's just the smell. Are you sure you're... I said I'm fine, okay? God damn, bro. Oh, what the fuck? There was someone looking at me from that tree? There's somebody up there. Oh my god, there is somebody up there. Can you tell? There's something up there, chat. You see that? Anyway, don't tell. Obviously, don't fucking. Here goes nothing. Yes! God damn! You see anything in there? No. Looks like it's been empty a while. Yeah, the top of the hour ad break is in there. Just kidding. You won't be able to see what's in there if you don't subscribe. For $5 or for free, that is, with a Twitch Prime. Whoo, top of the hour ad break. What are you close the damn grave? I think, I think so too, but... See if I can reach up in there. No, bro, you can't reach up in there. You gotta put Clementine through there. It's no good. I can't get it. Here, let me try. I think I can. Clem! God damn it, get back here! Clementine! She just fucking rolled in there so fast. That was really funny. Ta da! Good work, Clem. But don't go shooting off like that without asking first, okay? I was just trying to help. I know, and you did good. You just had me worried there for me. I gently Can warned we her. Maybe have this conversation inside. My leg's starting to hurt like hell. Gently, gently warned her. Warned her. I didn't like that she ran in there though. Looks okay from here. Fucking Everybody crawled in. in there. Like a goddamn rat. Why are you so mean to Clem? We're we're kind of beefing right now. If you don't know, she's been talking to a pedophile. On the radio and like giving him information is a little crazy of her to do that stop victim blaming uh, sorry, sorry he's nine bro no, that's still okay. fucked up you should know Good. better feel better already just being off my feet thanks babe if you treat her like she's eight she'll keep making mistakes okay so 
When were you gonna tell us about the radio? Tell you what? That it's working. That there's someone else on the other end of that thing. You didn't think that might have been worth sharing with the rest of us? I was gonna tell you. Kenny and I only found out yesterday. So both of you were keeping it from the rest of us. Great. Kenny was Who there? Who gives a shit about the damn radio? I'm more worried about whoever it was out there ringing that bell and bringing the dead down on top of us. It's like they didn't want us to make it to the river. What makes you think it's not the same person? Whoever was on the radio was close enough to see us in the street, and we didn't see anyone else other than the guy in the bell tower. Because that doesn't make a lick of damn sense. Why would they bring out the dead like that and then try to warn us about it? How much sense does anything make anymore? In case you haven't noticed, there's a lot of twisted folks out there these days. At least the dead don't play games with you. I do think Whoever they're stalking us. Seems like they're following us. And I don't like being followed. All the more reason to get on a damn boat where we can't be followed. Okay, bro. I'm not Kenny is like such a typical Florida boy, dude. He's just like, we got to get on a boat. Doesn't matter. <laughs> All problems will be solved by being on a boat, okay? Every moment that I'm on land, I hate it. I need to be on a boat right now. Like, no, man, he can probably fucking stalk us with the boat, too. He, if he stalked us with a train ride, he could probably stalk us with the boat ride, too, you know? Like, come Going on. Back out there I love boats. Soon. Omid needs to rest. We need to make sure Chuck is okay. Once it's quieted down outside, we'll all head towards the river. See if we can find him. Deal? Suit yourselves, and I'm not going to wait around too long for someone else to grab up those boats. That's our <laughs> ticket out of here. Bro, what do you mean? Bro, what do you fucking mean, dude? It's not like today where all the boats are going to be taken for, okay? Like, they're, they're not... All the boats are spoken for today. Should have came yesterday. <laughs> we had like 10 of them. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna wait for them, but at least I'll feel better when we know that for sure. We need to check the whole house. <sighs> All right, fine. You and me will take the upstairs. Lee, you've got down here. Make sure you check every door. Understand? Okay. Is there anything I can do? Thanks. I got it. Hang out with Chris and Omid until I get back. Okay. Lee, I'm sorry. What for? Going through the door like that without checking first? I guess that was pretty dumb, huh? Just ask me first the next time you're gonna outsmart all the grown-ups, okay? Okay. Ain't no zomber knows how to fucking operate a boat, I'll tell you what. Oh god, grandfather clocks are so ago. creepy. I don't know why. They're just so goddamn creepy. Clear this place out, left behind two bottles of whiskey. Looks like someone didn't have their priorities straight. Probably not the best idea right now. I need to stay frosty. Looks expensive and heavy. Doubt any looters would be able to haul that thing too far. When, I, when it says look at table, I didn't mean literally look at the table itself. I thought he was going to look at, like, what's oh, on the table. That's so funny that he just directly looked at the table. Nothing. Water's off. Hope we never get desperate enough for food that this starts looking appetizing. I'm surprised it hasn't. I'm not that hungry. Signs I need to finish checking the downstairs. How's it coming? <laughs> no power. I've tried it, it's not terrible. Aww. It's a child's dog. Four months in, I'll be eating that dog food, bro. I'll be like protein. You know what I mean? Oh, Fuck it. Out. No, dog food is that bad. Bro, it doesn't matter. What do you mean? You never know where your next meal is going to be. See, none of you motherfuckers have survival instincts. Like, 
I don't know why. I guess like living in a fat family, survival instincts are automatic. It kicks in. Where you immediately, when you sit at the table, it's like there's like a competition. To just like shove as much food down your throat as possible before Marat gets it. Not exactly my style. What painting is that, chat? I think I saw the original hey in. How's the house looking? Saw the original in Italy. The first floor yet, but so far so good. Is it Goya? Caravaggio? How's that couch treat? The Vinky? Oh my God! Feeling better yet? I'm all right. I feel you. Chat is so stupid, bro. Y'all don't know shit about art. This house was a hell of a stroke of luck. I like it a lot better. Judith beheading. Sure it's safe. Hello, Fernes by oh, Caravaggio. Sure. But right now it feels like just the break we needed. Maybe our luck's starting to turn around. I'd like to believe that. Really, I would. What do you guys think about this plan at Kinney's? The guy's losing it. Look, Lee, I know he's your friend and all, but you need to be careful. That man is on the edge, and I don't know if I want to be around when he goes over it. Kenny's solid. He's just been through a lot, that's all. I hope you're right. For all our sakes. Sit tight. I'll keep checking the first floor to make sure it's safe. Thanks, Lee. Bro, y'all will never get art ho pussy not knowing iconic paintings like that. Holding I'm just up, okay. saying. I hope this house is safe. Have you checked all the rooms to make sure? No, but I'll take care of it. Says the no music here and ass. Whatever, dude. I'm goaded. Nothing huh. hiding in here. That's what you think, bro. Wait, you're not gonna fucking loot the toilet? That's crazy. No survival instinct again. All right, let's get ready. Let's get ready to rumble, baby. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, it's a closet. All clear in here. Just one more to check. Is this test the Bechdel test? Yes. Jesus! Oh! What? What happened? It's nothing. <clears throat> I was not afraid. It's just oh, okay. Please ain't got much. We should be okay here for a while, at least until it quiets down outside. Good. Thanks. I was just faking it. Is it's faking okay? being scared. Yeah, for now. But I'm really worried his leg might have gotten infected. Don't suppose you turned up any meds while you were poking around? Nah, just dog food. And there's some whiskey in the back. Wait, whiskey would work? On the wound? I was just asking Clementine if she knows who the man on her radio is. It's okay, honey. You can tell us. Who is he? What does he want? Go ahead, Clem. It's okay. You're not in any trouble. I mean, you should be, but it's all right. It's just a friend. I don't think he wants to hurt us. What has he been saying to you? What have you been saying to him? I told him I was trying to find my parents and that they were in Savannah. He really seems nice. I think he wants to help me find them. Clementine, honey, trust me, that's not what he wants. He... Lee? Lee, you need to get up here now. Uh -oh. What's wrong? It's Kenny. Wait. Kenny said he thought he heard something up there. Went to go look. He's up there? Come on, Kennelled. Come Stay on, Kennelled. Come on, Kennethy. Oh, no. Jump scare times two. Is he fucking zombered? If he's zombered, I'm going to be so sad. I have to put his zombie body in the boat. You know what I mean? 
And I'm not talking right now because I'm afraid. And I'm talking to, you know, uh, Kenny? calm my senses. What the fuck? Kenny, you okay, man? Kennethy. Oh, Jesus. What the hell is that? Is that a dead oh child? God. Is that a dead kid? Wait, is he a fucking alive kid or is that a dead zomber kid? Oh, it's a dead zomber kid. Damn, a famished dead zomber kid. L. Kinda looks like duck, don't he? It's just a kid. What the hell happened to him? Ain't nothing on him. Guess he must have been hiding out up here. Starved to death. Jesus Christ. You're the wrong audience for this game? I can, Lee. Couldn't do it before. Can't do it now. Hey, give him the gun. You can do this, bro. I can't ask you to do this, man. I'll take care of it. Like I did before. Sure, it's fine. I can kill fucking zombie children. Sure? I guess we'll find out. Poor kid must have tried to hide out up here until he starved to death. He's like, come on, let me get a taste. If I hadn't found her when I did. <laughs> like, let me get a taste, dude. What do you mean, bro? Wait, you think I'm gonna waste fucking? You think I'm gonna waste so, bullets on this fucking thing? Get the fuck out of here! I'm literally saving its whatever remnants. We should bury him. Get the fuck out of here, Kenny! I'll take care of it. Bro, he's looking right at you, Kenny. That was crazy. Bro, I don't think you guys understand. First of all, I murdered someone, okay? And that was before the zombie apocalypse happened. I'm I'm a cold-blooded killer, dog. That's how it is. Hell is hot, Hazan. Yo, chatters talk about a Bordeaux. But you have no smoke for the abordo. Oh my god, we're putting him in the dog grave. Chatters will literally talk about aborting children, but then you can't even fucking abort a child after birth. You know what I mean? Pressed his skull like Panini. At least we're... At least we are burying him with his best friend. You know what I mean? At least there's a little bit of happiness there. Bro, stop looking at the boy. Just shovel the fucking loose dirt. Come on. What are you looking at, dude? We don't got a lot of time, Lee. Come on now. Clem. <laughs> Clem, come look. <laughs> come look what I found, Clem. <laughs> we're, we're doing an IDF rush? Oh, come on, dude. It's a zombie. A 
It's a zombie. All right, it's ah! Fuck! Ew! Oh my god. Oh my god. I think I literally. Hey! Oh, oh hey! my god. Oh my god. I squeezed too hard. Who are you? What the hell do you want from us? I squeezed too hard. I squeezed my shit so hard. I swear to God, I got an ab cramp a little bit. Fuck. Oh my God. 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 My toes hurt. <laughs> oh, oh my Lord. That shit is fucked up. I'm squeezing my shit too hard. Wait, what's going on? saw someone standing there by the fence watching us a walker no too fast took off like a bat out of hell when i spotted i curled my was toes was it a man or a woman didn't get a good enough look what does it matter i'm wondering if it's the same guy who's been following us the guy on the radio <laughs> kenny i'm fine i just i'm fine what's all the ruckus Lee saw someone watching us from outside the gate. What? Who? I can't oh, sure. how would I know, bro? I ran off before I could get a good look. I don't like this one bit. Not one bit. Me either. Walkers are one thing, but the thought of someone out there actually stalking us. All right, that's it. We stuck around here long enough. It's time to get back on track. Time to get down to the river and find ourselves a boat. I don't know if we'll move well enough <laughs> to move yet. Well, he better get ready. It's boat time. I'm going down to River Street right now to find a boat. And as soon as she's ready to go, we're moving out. We only checked the house to make sure it's secure. We didn't really toss the place. We're low on food, water, meds, ammo. We should make sure there's nothing here we can use before we move out. Will you search it if you want to? I'm done with this house. We came to this. He's so close. He can smell the sea, bro. This guy is a sea lion, okay? He's like, you know what'll fix this situation? A boat. <laughs> I've never had a bad time on a boat. <laughs> Let's get on a boat right now. You need to find a boat, and that's just what I'm gonna do. Maybe it's not such a bad idea to check the place. I more said I'm done with this house. That's crazy how much he loves boats, bro. We can do both, Ben. You take one last look around the place. Grab anything that looks useful. No, don't me split. Kenny go down to the river to get us don't a boat. Don't split. Wait, can't I come? My mom and dad can't be far now. Oh, wait, we're leaving Ben behind? Fuck yeah. Yeah, no, Ben, you can fucking kill yourself when you're in that house. Fucking asshole. Maybe we can look for them on the way to the river. Clem, honey, I, I think it'd be best if you stayed here with Ben. Damn it, I'm I leaving to watch her with Ben. Omid and Krista. Help them get ready to move out. You said I'm supposed to always stay close to you. I know it. It's just this once. Sometimes we all have to put aside what we want for the good of the group. Hey, don't worry. Is it a bad idea? I'll be back before you know it, okay? Did okay. I fuck this up? Oh, Daylight's shit. Daylight's burning. Gonna go grab my gear, then we'll head out. Come on, Clem. Let's go see if Omid needs anything. <sighs> Chad, don't spoil so it. you're just gonna leave me on the bench here? Yeah, don't spoil it. That's not how it is, Ben. I need you to stay here and keep an eye on Clementine. I can do that. Well, just so we're clear. While I'm gone, anything or anyone tries to get inside this house, you shoot them. Don't even think twice about it. Understand? I got no problem shooting walkers. Did you hear what I said? Anything or anyone? Good. I trust I trust the lady in Omid more than I trust Ben to look after Clementine. I'm gonna be honest. She's fierce. Chat, stop saying words ending unlocked. You guys are such fucking assholes, dude. Cause like you're also literally fucking spoiling it potentially. And I'm also worried and scared. Stop. Chat's being a bunch of ducks right now. I'm gonna be honest.
Duck chat. I don't know why I'm going with this fucking manic guy over here. He's fucking lost his mind. Hey, uh, so you want to talk about it? About what? About what happened back there in the attic. No. You sure, man? I mean, river's right up ahead. <laughs> Boats. <laughs> You know what that mean? Boat. <laughs> Son of a bitch. That bastard's fucking with us again. It's another trap. No, listen. That's not the same bell as before. This one's further off. Whatever it is, it's gonna get the dead moving over there. What in the hell is going on? Chad, this is an analogy. This is an analogy for religion r slash atheism okay on top i don't know but the person ringing that bell might be doing us a favor whatever man i find whoever's doing that i'll ring their motherfucking bell for them good one la campana resident evil hmm. let's keep moving Whoever comes in between me and my boat, gonna get fucked up. Still nothing moving behind us. I think we're... Oh my God. No boats. <laughs> There's gotta be a boat. There's gotta be. <laughs> Are you sure about that? Doesn't look like it to me. Maybe we need to start thinking about a plan B. This is the plan. It's the only one we've got, and you pissing on it in front of everyone like you did back at the house ain't exactly helping. Well, screw you. I ain't giving up that easy. My man needs his boat, bro. What are you gonna do? Make a boat out of a fucking truck? I mean, there's one over there that's like half capsized, half sunk. This one might still be salvageable. You better be right about this. I said it might be. Give me a fucking break. I'm a fishing captain, not a miracle worker. Wait, what happened? Oh, we got effed a little bit? Like the boat? Chat? Chat just withstood a little bit of an F? We might, it might be salvageable. You know what I mean? It might be salvageable. Just like the boat that we're watching it right now. I don't know why the fuck we're trusting a dude who named his son Duck, but. I'll check it out. You look further along the waterfront. Maybe there's something at the other end. I don't think we should split up too far. We don't have to. Refresh if you're having a hard time with the, the bit. If it's still from right here. See what skipping. you can find. Okay. I'm from here. That river's full of gators. Rivers full of not just regular old gators. River would be full of zomber gators. Look through the telescope. Great. Needs a quarter to work. That's crazy. Oh, they're alive still. What the fuck? Bro, what, did you put these zombers up as a warning to other zombos? Like, what the hell? What the fuck? <laughs> Is this meant to be some kind of warning? We'll do something like this. Using walkers like scarecrows. What sick bastard did this? Unless they weren't walkers at first. This barricade does a good job of making me not want to go any further. Yeah, unless they weren't zombos at first, they were human and then they died on there. What the hell are these markings? They're all over the place. Oh, 
There ain't nothing here on the side street. Okay. Could be military tags, but what do they mean? Watch out, Turkish man. Vlad Dracula made it to Atlanta. Oh, there might be a quarter in here. Hello, beautiful. Empty. Yeah, that would have been too easy. Come on now. Why you gotta make fun of me like that? They already cleaned this place out. What are you gonna do with quarters anyway in the fucking zombie apocalypse? Why'd they clean it out? Someone already looted the place. Must have taken weeks to board up all these windows. Looks like the whole city has been boarded up for all the good it did. I wonder if they boarded the city up because they were um, infected and they were placed under quarantine. It's too dangerous out here. Or if they, yeah, Larry had all the last change in the city. Um, man, I could go for sixty cents right about now. Maybe in here. Looks like it's still intact. There we go. There you go. Easy peasy, baby. Gas siphoned. Tires removed. Engine parts missing. Looks like this thing has been stripped clean. Yeah, but for what purpose? What can you do with the... I guess you can use a lot of the different car... been a hell of a wreck. Can't go further down that direction. Okay. Someone must have been trying to back their boat into the water. Only things didn't go as planned. Hey, uh, Kenny. The hell you waiting for? We need to look through that telescope to see if there are any other boats out there. Oh my god, he's so obsessed with the boat situation. Bro, you got a, you got issues, man. He's got boat autism. What's up with the boat? It ain't gonna work. Hull's cracked beneath the waterline, plus someone stripped out the battery. You can't fix it? What the... what the hell is that? A fate worse than death. The zombie's gonna pop in. Abandoned, like every other place in this city. It don't look like no boat. No way that one's salvageable. The Talmadge Memorial Bridge. Can't imagine how many people tried to escape across it when the city started to fall. Nothing but water, not a boat to be seen. Oh, what the, the fuck? Hell? Bro, what is this dude doing? Get down, get down. What is he doing? Oops. Why the hell are we hiding? Someone came down from that building at the end of the street. Where'd he go? Saw him run into that newsstand. Could be our bell ringer. How about we go find out? Sounds like a plan. Okay, you head up the middle of the street. I'll go around the side, cover your flank. We'll come up on him quiet, take him by surprise. We just want to talk to this guy. Oh, we're gonna talk. He's like, I'll let the gat do the talking. Out here in these streets, 
We let the gun do the talking. What the fuck? What the? Oh my god, how is that even possible? Oh wait, I hit it! Bro, I hit it too. That's a lady. No! Oh my god, Clem. How the fuck did Clem get here? Yo, Ben. Ben needs to be killed. Okay? Ben needs to be assassinated by Bayraktar drone. Okay? Like, dude, how are you so bad at, like, the most basic shit? I have so many questions. What the fuck is Kenny doing? Okay? I cannot rely on a single person. The only person I can rely on is, is honestly, Clementine. That's it. Kenny, you better be fucking dead around that corner, you son of a bitch. You were supposed to, you were supposed to be my backup. You're not from Crawford. Crawford? What the hell are you talking about? Don't shoot her now, dumb fuck. Kenny, don't! Oh, fuck. Now the Zombers hurt us. No, he's with us! Who the hell are you people? Kenny, back off. Unless you want this lady to give you another ass whooping. Who are you calling Lady? The name's Molly. Molly? Wait, what? I'm Lee. This is Kenny and Clementine. Are they non-binary? Are they non-binary? Hi. You guys really aren't from Crawford, are you? I don't even know what that is. Everything beyond that barricade. What the hell happened here? You sure you want to know? Yeah, that's why I asked. What the hell happened When here? everything started going to shit, some people got together and sealed off that whole neighborhood. Folks willing to do anything to stay alive. Stop the dead getting in. I try to avoid them. Why? Let's just say they have a zero tolerance policy for anyone who won't or can't live by their rules. So how'd you know we weren't them? Because they have a because no there child. Are no children in Crawford, not anymore. No child policy. Why they grew up? What do you mean, no children? Why not? They no ate children, them. Children, no elderly, no one with an advanced medical condition. Basically, no one who might be a burden on the community. Oh, they're fascists. Crawford's all about the survival of the fittest. They're fasci. That's how they survived, while the rest of the world went to shit around them. Jesus Christ. Okay, she's basically saying fascism well, works though. That's weird. When you think about it. What exactly did Crawford do with all these burdens? What happened to them? Well, you met some of them already. Fuck me. Yeah. Anyone who got sick, anyone too old, anyone they figured wasn't strong enough to survive. To them, those people were just mouths to feed. A drain on their precious resources. <laughs> Look at their practical results. <laughs> Come on, Chatter. Everyone in Savannah knew. What was going on inside Crawford got passed around like a ghost story. Except this one was true. If you can't bench at least... You Body know, weight, you die. Bells all over town. Yeah, that would be me. I knew it, Lee. I knew she was the one who's been following us, fucking with us. Get that finger out of my face, Grandpa, before I jam it straight up your ass. Bro, she would have made it in Crawford. You. I don't even know who the hell you people are. 
Calm down, Kenny. The voice on the radio was a guy, remember? Yeah, well, whoever you are, ringing those bells this morning nearly got us all killed. Raise the dead all around us. That's the idea, genius. It's how I get around. I ring a bell in one neighborhood to attract the local geeks towards it. Buys me some time to scavenge the areas they cleared out. Whoa, geeks. geek? The G word? Chill. Grandpa and geek? This is so 2010 coded. I haven't heard somebody say geek in so long. I like, I forgot that word existed entirely. Is that what you call him? Yeah, you know, like at the carnival? They'll eat anything, alive or dead. That's pretty smart with the bells. Doesn't take much to outsmart the dead. Bunch of dumbasses. You just gotta move fast. Get in and out before they start to wander back again. Look, I'm gonna ask you people again. You're not from Crawford, so who the hell are you? What are you doing here? Boats! Came down here looking for a boat. Hoping to get our people out of here and find someplace safe. Yeah, good luck with that. Anyone with a boat took it out of here as soon as people started eating each other. Any that got left behind, Crawford stripped them for parts. Cars, too. There's gotta be something. If there was, do you think I'd still be here? I've been over every inch of this city. This whole place <laughs> Add the is rogue between. to your party. I would God like to. Damn it! Fuck! Hey, moron. You want to keep your voice down? Bro, we shot a gun. Shit. Since you're not <laughs> getting on any boat, I'd advise you folks to go back to where you came from before. Great. Well. Just great. Isn't that the the way we came? Fuck. Gunshot must have brought him back. Isn't there another way back to the house? Mom, is there a Well, guess we gotta follow her ass, dude. Oh my god, bro, she's doing parkour. You just gonna let her go? Hey! You can't just leave us here! Really? Watch! No! Please! Please don't leave us! Throw the little girl up there. Come on, make it fast. She's resourceful. Throw the little girl up there. We'll deal with the rest oh, of it on our me. own. Come on, come on, hurry! Me, come on! Come on, man. One good jump. Oh my God, Kenny, you fucking no. suck. This is the second time you did this shit to me, Kenny. Dump some bitch. All right, push it back, push it back, pull it back, pull it back. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, I'm so cooked. Come on, Lee, get your ass out of there. Wait, what? What the hell? I can't get it open. Here, use that to pry it open. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. They can't come down here, right? Wait, why won't they just fall in here head first? I guess if they fall in here head first, they're gonna fucking break their skulls and die. Oh! Yep. There you go. Clementine! Oh can you hear me? If you oh my god, bro. Sewer mission? Are you serious? Pre-gamed? I mean, I'm a gamer. And hear me. Just get back to the house, okay? I'll meet you there. How are you going to get the fuck out of there? Shit. Just wait him out, bro. And then go back up. That's what you should be doing, but... Solid. She literally no gave me pry that open. She literally gave me her one fucking tool, so she can't go too far now. Wait, there's a tire down here. What the hell? I'm gonna slip and fall. One hundo P. You have to at this point. Oh, wow. No classic slip and fall. 
Dead rat? Half-eaten sewer rats. Walkers must be down here, too. Ain't touching that. Last thing I need is some god-awful disease. I mean... Never know, we might might be useful. Might toss them in the way. The free meal, bro. This guy, no, no survival instincts. That's what I mean, chat. Like, I would have eaten that rat. I would have eaten the dog food at least. I'd be full right now. I'd have a full belly. A drainage pipe. Oh, I hear zombers. Are there zombies around this fucking corner? Yes, there are. Could be the way out. There's no way I could take on all of those things by myself. Looks like some kind of drainage pipe. Wait. If I hit the wrong direction on this bad boy, I'm cooked. Locked. Which way, chat? I'm going to turn it right. Oops. Good thing I'm out here and not in there. Hmm. Seems loose. Shit. Should I try the other way around? Maybe I can pry this fucking thing. Oh, there it is. Let's freaking go, son. Come on, daddy. Work with me now. I'm going to put the gameplay on YouTube chat. Yes. Uh oh. Feet don't fail me now. I'm going to need to take that off. No. I can't take it out. The fuck? Can I close the door behind me? No. That's crazy. I can't. I got a gun, but I don't have enough. I probably don't have enough bullets and shit. Is there one more? There's always one more. Oh, this dumbass didn't move. Oh, it's Chuck. What the oh fuck? My God. Chuck, he must have tried to hide out down here. Fuck. Poor bastard. No bullets. He must have saved the last one for himself. You deserve better, old man. We lost a fucking bard, boys. We lost a fucking bard. Dude, my heart is racing right now. No memes. He was a good man. He was the best man. I have to pop it. What the fuck? Oh. Go, God damn it. Fuck you. Easy peasy, baby. No, no, no voices, no nothing. 
shit. Bro, that fucking pickaxe is so sick. No way I could pick that up on my own. Wait, really? This is just a fucking broken ladder. What do you mean you can't pick it up on your own, bitch ass? Pick up door? Locked. Fucking perfect. these bars with this how is he gonna be able to fucking pick his body weight up with that thing if he can't even open basic shit damn i can't reach it am i gonna be able to it's just a sign <laughs> he's like mad at me that i'm let's see if it works jump up and clamp it ah! oh my god what the uh, hell Turns out it's not just a sign, is it? Dumbo. Oh, guess we gotta go in there. Guess we gotta get in the hole. Secret tunnel. That's what we're doing. A Kamas tunnel. Kamas. Must have been one of those old nuclear fallout shelters. Oh my god, is there Someone supplies? Are you for fucking real right Look now? At all this. Bro, it's eat some. To keep people alive for months. Eat some. You gotta eat some, big dog. I mean, come on now. No survival instinct. No survival. Zero survival instinct on this bitch. He's such a bitch. He's, he's not surviving. He's not making it out. Lee, we are not making it out. Oh my God. Is this the Crawford family? Who are you? <laughs> it's all right. It's okay. I, I don't want any trouble. Neither do we. Which is why you'd do well to turn around and leave right now. Nah, they're old. Look, I'm sorry I disturbed you folks. I'll just be going. You can't let him leave. He's from Crawford. If he goes back there and they find out we're down here. Are you from Crawford? They don't lie to me. I know. Where else can he be from? Everywhere else around here is dead. I'm not from around here. I'm from Athens. Grew up in Macon. I have a brother in Macon. You were there? How was it? As bad as here? I'm sorry. You can't trust him, Vernon. You can't let him leave. What do you want me to do? Shoot him in the head? Why not? Be more of a mercy than anyone from Crawford ever showed us. Think, Vernon. What do you think they'll do if they find out we're down here, right under their feet? Damn it. You're right. I'm sorry, friend. Can't take the risk. Look, you don't want to do this. Let's talk, okay? What's to talk about? You won't even tell us who you are. My name is Lee. I'm a history professor. And I don't want to die today. And I don't think you want to kill me either. Don't. Don't come any closer, or I'll shoot. I'll shoot you. I come will. On. Let's just talk about this. He's a whimsical Vernon, old man. What are you man. doing? Shoot him! Nobody needs to get shot. Just take it easy. It's all right. It's okay. Vernon, what the hell are you doing? Vernon! Damn. Crawford boys would have eaten their asses alive, bro. To be honest, bro, the Crawford guys probably should kill them because that's a major L. You gave your gun. To a random person that just walked into your secret compound. Like, that's crazy. That's crazy. I took the gun. I got like three guns on me now. Holy shit. I'm like fucking revolver. Ocelot. I was going to say octagon. You're really not from Crawford? No. Yeah, she can't be that racist. She has a black friend. I'm really not. Well... We are, or were. We got out of there when they started sealing up the place, you know, started weeding out the sick and the old so their perfect survivor society wouldn't be threatened. No room for weakness or vulnerability in their little master race. You don't look that old, so you're sick? We're sick. 
We're all members of a cancer survivors group that used to meet here at the hospital. We're in remission. But that wasn't good enough for Crawford. They'd already rounded up five of us before the rest of us managed to hole up and hide from them down here. This old basement's been abandoned for years. What is this? The morgue? Yeah. Irony's always high on my list when I'm looking for a place to survive. How did you find your way down here? My group and I were up by the river looking for a boat. Now I just want to get out of here and find them again. Well, that sewer system you came through runs all over the city. It'll take you wherever you want to go. Those sewers are like a damn maze. Any chance you could help me find my way back? Look, I'd like to help you, but we've all got our own problems. Two of our group are sick and need constant care, and I'm the only doctor here. Besides, why should we help you? Damn, lady, you're racist as hell. Look, I'm sorry if I scared you. I just want to get back to my people. Back to Clementine. She's your daughter? Yeah. She's probably already wondering where I am. Well, we can't have that, can I'm we? just lying. Aaron, what the hell are I you doing? I adopted her. Fuck it. It's all right, no rules. Lee. I had a daughter, too. Lost her in the first days. I'll be damned if I'll just sit back and let that happen to someone else. We need you here. Don't worry. I'll be back before you know it. Let's go see about your daughter. She is my daughter. Sorry. I'm the father that stepped up, bitch. What do you mean? Why do you make the worst decisions? It's a good decision. It's the truth. This is how I come out as, as officially adopting her. Damn, I'm just fucking taking their one doctor away from them. They are so cooked. She's definitely going to die. Time. Clem? They never come back? Oh, they did. Molly? Oh, hey, you made it back. Who's this? He didn't tell you about me? Understandable, I guess. I'm the one who put that beating on him when he tried to jump me back at the river. Who's the fossil? Chill, bro. You sound a lot like Clementine, dude. This is Vernon. He's a doctor. He helped me get back here after we got separated. I think you have something that belongs to me. That shit was so useful. Bro, there is no way she's just gonna fucking hook shot her way out of here she's just gonna leave lee thank god you're back krista what's wrong it's omid he's gotten worse much worse we have a man wounded who's this this is vernon he's a doctor oh thank god could you take a look at him you have to help us please where the fuck is coming to her? Why don't I give a shit? I'll see all of what I sudden. can do. Take me to him, Doctor. I got a disease. It's called the top of the hour ad break, and the only cure is a three minute ad. The only cure a five dollar a month subscription. I fucked it up. Yeah, you guys are about to get ligma. <laughs> Aiden 1010. 10. Shut the fuck up, Aiden. I fumbled it. I fumbled the bag. Omid, honey, you're gonna be all right. <sighs> we brought a doctor. All right, let's take a look at him. I work better without an audience. Now, why don't you go find your little girl? Clementine. Clementine? This is a big ass house, bro. It's like my 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 mansion. Clementine, you in here? Where is she? I gotta loot a little bit while I'm in here, you know what I mean? Clementine? Come on now. Come on now. He's a cannibal too, calling Clem, it. Bro, you have no.
Grimm's drawings. But where oh my god. <laughs> that drawing is ass, dude. Don't see her anywhere out there. Uh, no walkers either, though. Lamb. Everything okay in there? We're fine. Just leave us alone and let the doctor work. <laughs> that moan was weird, bro. I thought he was I thought that was Kenny jerking Limitar. it. You hear? I'm not even kidding. I thought it was Kenny cranking it in there. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, this bathroom's got a that. bathroom's got a room in and of itself. That's crazy. Hello. Those shared bathrooms what are you doing? suck. Oh, uh, you know, just poking around. You won't find anything. We already searched the place. You'd be surprised what people miss. Trust me, I've been doing this for a while. Morning while jerking it is crazy. Don't what I got me. oil on my shit right now. I'm okay. stroking my shit Do I so look hard. Like I'm in the mood to be jerked around. Where did she go? Last I saw, she was downstairs with your redneck friend and that college kid who hangs around with him. Why don't you go bug them? College kid? Isn't Ben like 16? I don't care about that. I just want to find Clementine. Bro, chill. It's good to fucking loot a little bit, you know what I mean? Call Kenny a redneck, which is valid to be honest. Clementine, you up there? Shit, where could she be? Am I gonna see the dude outside again? Don't see her out there. Clem? Why is this so Clementine? unnecessarily tense, bro? Clementine, come out! Please! Kenny? Oh, hey, you made it back. Good job. Good job. What the hell do you think you're doing? What does it look like? Where'd you get the bottle? Found it. First good thing that's happened since... Hey, take it easy. Think you've had enough. To hell with you! Getting wasted's not gonna help anyone. Yeah? Well, what is? We are fucked! Bro, you're being Molly real laryled right now. there's not a single boat left in Savannah. No way out. Bro, the boat thing? Okay, here's what it is. He was clinging out of the boat thing after his family died because, like, he wanted to focus on one goal and one goal only. And then once that goal was, obviously, it, it, it became something that is not accomplishable he's just like falling apart i know i'd like to joke about how it's like oh he just loves he's just a boatist a boat autist and not being in the the vicinity of boats causes him great distress i think that's what it is it's all coming crashing down right now he's just like being reminded of the fact that you know his wife killed herself and his son got domed by me right in front of him where i one framed him Obviously, as he was turning into a zombo. I'm still proud of that. They call me Quick Draw McGraw, baby. We got walkers all around us. That crazy fuck on the radio messing with us. Hell, if now ain't the time for a drink... Bro, where the fuck is Clementine, Have though? Have of you seen Clementine? Damned if I know. Gotta be around here somewhere. Ben, I gave you one job when I left here. Take care of Clementine. Then she shows up out on River Street looking for me. What the hell happened? Hey, don't put all that on me. Omid took a turn for the worse, and Krista asked me to help. I'm sorry, I'm doing the best I can here. 
She was frantic and things got kind of crazy. I told Clementine to stay put. What else could I do? Don't be sorry. Just tell me where the hell she is now. I what? think she went out to play in the backyard. On her own. With no one watching her? Bro. Man, will you get off my back? She's fine out there. Bro, I'm ass. going to fucking kill you, dude. I'm going to go find her and then I'm going to kill you. Oh my God, Clementine? I'm so mad. Clementine! The dude took her. One hundo P, the stalker took her. What the hell happened back here? Doors covered in vines. Don't think anyone came in through there. It's like remarkable how incompetent he is. in the doghouse she does like crawling into little places bro where the fuck is this girl god damn it is she in the bushes oh my god oh my god this is giving me anxiety wait can I go through here at all like we opened the vent I'm so stressed. Wait, she's not back here. I tried everything. Right? Look at the vent again. What the? That's it? I'm just pacing around this fucking backyard. Go in the shed? I can't, bro. There's vines in the... Oh! The door just moved. Door's covered in vines. Don't think anyone came in through there. Zomber? Zomber? Oh my god. <laughs> doing in there exploring and look look what i found god damn it clementine you have to stop wandering off i don't want to yell at you but sometimes a little bit of stern parenting is necessary i think right oh my god she found a boat that's crazy oh my god oh my god oh my god whoa i know right? i almost cursed in front of clem How are you going to boat while drunk? Just kidding. That's a fucking joke. He's Floridian. This is the only way these motherfuckers boat. Clemming goat. True. It's Clemming time. Bro. I swear to God. Clementine has in her pinky, in her pinky nail, more useful skills than 1,000 bends. Okay. I mean, it's just shocking how useless this dumb fucking... Bro, if this game came out in 2024, you know Ben would have the broccoli hair. Okay? You know they would have put that broccoli hair shit up on that. He would be a kick watcher. He would be an Aiden Ross subscriber. Talking on God for real, for real. Just fucking objectively useless.
Ben is simply not an asset, but a burden. Crazy. Omid's doing okay? As well as can be expected under the circumstances. I did what I could for him. Cleaned out the wound, but he's got a real infection. Running a fever. Without antibiotics, I... Will you quit pacing? You're making everyone nervous. Why are you even still here? Hey, if your friend really can get that boat working, you're taking me with you as payment for saving your asses. I figure that's fair enough, don't you? She's useful. Well? You want the good news or the bad news? Let's get the bad news out of the way first. Bad news is, she's not taking us anywhere the shape she's in right now. Gas tank's empty and the battery's dead. So what's the good news? That's salvageable. That's, it. That's all she needs. Some gas and a battery. Other than that, she's good to go. Well, how are we supposed to get that stuff? Sounds like Crawford is the one place that has everything we need. Maybe we should try there. Now hold on a minute. Surely we have to try? If there are people left in this city who are still alive, who still have supplies, what harm can it do to ask? Trust me, you don't know these people. I do. You showing up with a wounded man? Might as well put a noose around his neck. They don't exactly welcome children with open arms either. What the hell kind of a place are we talking about here? The worst kind? But I don't see what other choice we have. And just how exactly do you figure we do this? Because I know. from what I've heard, that place ain't exactly friendly to outsiders. I know. We negotiate. Are you ready for this? We give them Ben. He's young. He looks like he's able-bodied. They won't know. We sell Ben to them. And guess what? Win-win. Because Ben inevitably will cause societal collapse. Crawford's over. Cancer patients end up taking over Crawford. Win, win, win. We negotiate with them like civilized people. We must have something they'd be interested in taking in trade. Negotiate? With Crawford? Once again, I have to remind you. You have no idea what these people are like. They'll take what they want, and then decide whether or not to let any of you live. So what? No one has any ideas? There might actually be a way. I know the sewer system that runs beneath Crawford like the back of my hand. Y'all wouldn't happen to have a map by any chance. Yeah, actually. I think I could lead us through so we could pass under the perimeter and right into the center where they keep their supplies. We come up right underneath them, take them by surprise, grab what we need, and get out before they even knew what hit them. Okay, that's not bad. That's better. I've thought about it before, just never had the people to do it. But I think if we all work together, we could pull it off. And what do you want in return for all this help you're giving us? Crawford doesn't just have what you need for your boat. They're also well stocked with medical supplies. Medicine that my people could use, just as yours could. We can do this. We have to. So, it's decided then? We're going to Crawford? Anyone else have a problem with this plan? Because we're gonna need every one of us to pull this off. Man, I don't know. Oh. I don't know about you, kid, but I'd rather take a chance on doing something than just sitting around here waiting to die. That boat out there is an answered prayer. Sucks. Just gotta push a little bit farther. Are you in or out? We should go tonight, under cover of dark. I'll go let my people know. Give you all a chance to prepare. I'll be back before midnight. Be careful. That's how I'm still alive. 
I fucking hate Ben so much. I think my my idea was the best I told idea. You to stay in your room. How long have you been there? Is it going to be dangerous? Is what going to be dangerous? Crawford. I can't lie to you, Clem. Yeah, it's going to be dangerous. But it's the only way to get the things we need to make Omi better and get the boat working. That's why we have to do this. Do you understand? I don't want anyone else to die. Maybe Ben. No one else is gonna die. I promise. You can't promise that. Damn, she knows. That's cold, bro. She's like eight years old. And she already fucking knows. That's crazy to me. No, I guess I can't. Sorry. Take the L, Lee. go get ready. Uh, say what now? You said you'd need all of us to do this, and you said I'm a big help, remember? Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my mom and dad are, right? I don't think I'll find them in Crawford, Sweet Pea. Why not? Because they're good people. And Crawford is a bad place run by bad people. I don't think they would have stayed in a place like that. How do you know they're good if you've never met them? Oh my but God. Bro. She's owning me. She's literally fucking destroying me in the marketplace of ideas, bro. That's it. I'm taking her little ass with me, dude. Fuck it. She's too damn smart for her own damn good. Okay. It's like, actually, that's a logical fallacy, dad. They raised you, didn't they? Double logic. Can't I come with you? Should I bring her? Okay, you can come, but you have to promise to stay quiet and do exactly what you're told the whole time we're there. Okay, I'm gonna go get ready. Fuck it, YOLO mode. Bro, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm not leaving her behind with Ben again. Okay. Yeah. I would much rather, I would rather take her into the genocidal fascist state of Crawford than fucking leave her behind with dumbass Ben. This is not happening. Straight up. Ben will get her killed. One hundo P. I leave her behind with stupid ass Ben. Ben's going to be like, oh, I thought it would be cool to play with the zombies. I didn't understand that they eat brains. You know what I mean? Check out what I found in the garage. Hatchet, hacksaw, some other tools. Might come in handy on this little break in. Nice. Can I talk to you a minute? He'd be like, bro, bro. Lay off me, okay? I didn't realize zombies eat baby brains. Like, lay off me. 
What's up? I took another look at the boat. She's a 30-footer. So? So, we're gonna have a capacity problem. Assuming everyone makes it back alive, there ain't gonna be room for everyone. Say what no more, fam. Ben's say? dead. Just giving you... Say no more, fam. Ben is so dead. I'm killing him myself. Well, Don't worry. All. Thought you ought to know. Who the hell is this? This is Bree. She can help us. Good. How? We're gonna need all the help we can get. I was a student at the school where Crawford keeps their supplies. I know the layout. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get moving. <laughs> How is kind of ruthless. How is such a ruthless ass response? Hold up just a sec. You ready? Ready. Hey, whoa, hold on a minute. You're not taking her with us. Did you not hear anything I said about the kind of place Crawford is? If you take her in there and they find her... I'm not leaving her alone in the house with only Omi to protect her. It's just not happening. For what it's worth, I don't think it's a great idea either. She's coming. Deal with it. You heard the man. Let's move out. Omega Law mid. Bro, close the fucking boat gate. Oh my god, these people are so dumb. No survival skills, bro. How did you make it this far? Close the fucking gate with a boat in it so you're not... It. We're right underneath the center of Crawford. The old school should be directly above us. Okay, people. This is it. Left the light the on. We stay quiet. We stay hidden. And we stay together. We find what we need, and we get the hell... Chat, quick tip. When you want to do a sneaking mission... It's good to have all the old people, men, women, children. You. You would. That's what you got to do. Why, you might ask. It's to toss as many. It's to toss as many people in the direction of gunfire. Before anyone even knows we're there. Got it. And that part about staying close, that goes double for you. It's called bait. Can't get a good look above with the cover on. <laughs> Bro, we open it and they're right on top of us. That'd be really funny. They're like, we've been waiting for you. Let's go. Is everybody? There should be guards patrolling. What? Are you disappointed? It's just strange, is all. I think I see one over there by the door. Okay. Me and Kenny will sneak up, trying to take him out quiet. The rest of you wait for our signal, then follow it's us. It's quiet. Over. Too everybody quiet. Got it? Okay, Kenny, let's do this quiet. No shooting unless there's no other choice. Kenny is right so gung ho. You. Kenny one hundo P. What the fuck? Bro, there's zombies in what here. What the fuck is a walker doing inside here? Get inside, I'm... fast! Bro, I don't think they have any more people left in Crawford. I'm gonna keep it above 50. I think fascism turned into the mindless zomber virus that it already was even when they were alive, if you know what I mean. Shocked to find out that fascists failed. Fuck, fuck. Do you think they saw us? I don't think so. I think we're good, for now at least. What the hell happened here? I thought this place was supposed to be secure. What always happens, I guess. In the end, 
The dead always win. Oh man, we are so screwed. No, this is good. Vernon's right. We can deal with walkers easier than armed guards. I agree. So long as we don't let them box us in, we can still do this. The plan hasn't changed. The plan hasn't changed? Every time walkers show up, the plan changes. Do you even have any idea how many of them are out there? No. You want to do a head count? Or do you want to get what we need and get the hell out of here? Come on. I think I know which way to head. Where the fuck's Clem, by the way? Oh, she's behind. Okay, good. I got a God. bad feeling about this. God, I can't wait to fucking sacrifice Ben. Please. These games never let you fucking sacrifice who you want to sacrifice. It always gives you the tough choices, like... Except for when I killed Duck. Hmm, I wonder what's behind this boarded up door. Just keep moving. Here. Looks okay. Everybody Don't zombies in. open inside. Oh, that must mean that there are no zombies in there and we should open it to see what's inside. <laughs> Figures. Well, somebody's got to have the keys on them. Looks like they were using this room as some kind of command center. Hamas. <laughs> Hamas command center. Okay, so now what? They're all babies. As you can see, Hamas was using this Scooby Doo drawing to show that they are interested in killing the Jewish dogs. Only Jewish dogs will be murdered. They hate the Jews. They hate, they don't like uh, not Muslim dogs. They love Muslim dogs. Here. <laughs> Here is a copy of Mein Kampf annotated. Do not say that I brought it in myself. <sighs> what about the medicine? Oh fuck! I fucking right I here. was too busy Nurses memeing. Station. They were using it as a medical facility. How do you know that? Just makes sense, doesn't it? Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. Where can we find some fuel for the boat? That's interesting. There's a maintenance shed across from the playground here. If they were storing fuel, that's probably where it'll be. So then we just need a battery. This auto shop. It's right next door. Yep, it's called Herman's. You can't miss it. Okay, I'll make the run to the... Is why you can't trust blonde women, okay? The maintenance shed for the fuel. It'll be faster if I go with you. I can take you right to it. I'll come too. No, two people's enough. You stay here, see if you can use any of those tools we brought to get that armory door open. We might need to shoot our way out of here. I'll go for the medicine. I'll come with you. I know what to take. Okay. Guess that leaves me to go find us a battery. I'll go with you. Watch your back. Okay, we've got a plan. Everyone be careful. Stay close to one another. We'll all meet back here. Good luck. You also can't trust people who do parkour. I agree. What about me? What can I do? I need you to stay here with Ben and watch over our command center. Oh no. Charge. Bro, I literally didn't want to leave her behind because I didn't want to leave her with Ben and now she's staying with Ben? Oh hell no, Lee. Come on, there's got to be an option for me to fix this fucking thing. There's no shot I ain't leaving her with Ben, bro. I might as well have left her with Omid. Like, come on, dude. 
Anybody but Benny boy. Ben sucks. Yeah, look at her face. She's like, Lee. Lee. Okay. <laughs> You're leaving me with Ben? I'm not leaving <laughs> you with Ben. I'm leaving him with you. Understand? Oh, Bro, even okay. she knows. Back before you know it. Even she knows. Even she knows it's a bad idea. It's a big mistake. The Georgia state flag. A lot of history there. Not that it matters much now, I guess. Nothing but crayons and construction paper. Or you can use that. <sighs> so according to Bree, fuel is at the maintenance shed. Medicine might be at the nurse's office. And a battery would probably be at the auto shop out through here. If we're gonna find medicine anywhere, that would be the place to look. Bree said the entrance to the auto shop was in the alleyway by this fire escape. Okay, chat. Look at this map while I go pee. Memorize it, okay? I'm gonna ask you guys for... I'm gonna ask you guys. I'm gonna quiz you on it. All right, Chad, are you guys, do you have your notes ready? Uh, the fuel's in a shed across from the playground. It's just outside the stairwell. Hopscotch. Creepy. Might come back for these later. Any reading material would be nice once we get on that boat. No power, no TV. Looks like they had quite a system here. Crawford's final solution. Damn. Nazi shit. Number of citizens brought to Crawford, number of walkers found, Dason's outbreak, initials of the person conducting search, number of ineligible citizens found. Oh my god. They were methodical. Have to wonder what's going on in the rest of the world. Just a bunch of paste. China would be fine. China would have this shit locked down. Looking at what happened with COVID, honestly. China would have had this shit locked down in a minute. They would have executed like half the fucking population and they would have been locked the fuck down. Must be the guy who ran this place. Looks like he figured himself as some kind of supreme leader.
nothing in there. The alleyway to the auto shops down here. You coming or not? Why are you fucking yelling so much? Chill, dude. Shell casings all over. Whatever happened here, it wasn't good. Jesus Christ, this scared the shit out of me. They've already been fired. They're worthless. I'm such a looter, I was gonna... Too bad I don't know the combination to any of these. This must be the door to the alleyway where the auto shop is. But where the hell is Molly? I'm gonna open up the logger and see Ben in there. Someone shoved Bobby, him. You out here? Bro, Molly is sus as hell, dude. Guess I'm not going that way. Auto shop must be down this way. You think? Oh! Was that Molly? Herman's. This is the place I'm looking for. I think that was Molly or a Zomber chat. Bro, I hate these fucking angles, I swear to God. Fuck. Wait, is this the right? Where am I going? How do I? Well, climbing the fence isn't an option. What the fuck do I do now? Get on the shed roof, maybe? No. Nope. Useless? Bro, what do you mean? I went into the shed. There's nothing in there. Oh. Okay, well, maybe there is something in there. It's going to break. Oh, wow. It didn't break. How the fuck do we get back, though? That's the real question. Also, where the fuck is Molly? Must be the entrance to that auto shop where Bree said we'd find that battery. Where the fuck is Molly, bro? <laughs> Better not get too close. Game's running 144 piece. Damn, it's jammed tight. Sure would love some help from Molly right about now. Molly, dearest. Come on. Oh! Leave him! He's mine. Where the hell have you been? <laughs> Molly? <laughs> Molly! What? I think you got him. One more. <laughs> For luck. He's wearing medical scrubs. Some kind of scientist or doctor, maybe? Yeah, well, he ain't shit now. <sighs> Did you find us a way in? Yeah, but the garage door's jammed. Can't raise it.
Not a problem. Look what I found. Oh yeah, that'll work. Oh, zombers, zombarinos. Oh come on, bro. Why are they so resourceful in the worst moments too? Bro, go push the fucking thing back. What are you doing? Just go push the fence back up. That's so dumb. Oh, you have to have a QTE moment. You know what I mean? Have to do it to him. Have to have a QTE moment, chat. Wait, he didn't actually kill the fucking Zomberino? Bro, ain't no way. Take a look around. I'll make sure no stragglers get under this door. That blinking must be an anti-theft system. Good chance of a working battery being in that car. If I can find a way to get up there. And a good chance it's going to be loud as shit. Looks like Crawford had their own semi-trucks. No battery. Or the battery's dead. That's a battery. Well, I can see where the battery should be, but it's not. <sighs> Is that not a battery up there, chat? Look at this. That's a battery. Let's talk to Molly about what she just did. Something you need? What do you think happened to Crawford? Don't know, don't care. As far as I'm concerned, these fuckers got what was coming to them. Not a lot of sympathy for all the people who died here, huh? I have about as much for them as they did for the sick and the old and anyone else they didn't think was fit to belong in their little paradise. So yeah, fuck them. What was all that about back there? He came at me up on that rooftop, tried to take a bite out of me, so I took care of business. What, you got a problem with me killing geeks? No. Nah. It just seemed like you went to town on him a little more than you needed to. Hey, you never really know when those things are all the way dead. I was just making sure. Look, you want to get this battery or not, time's wasting. So why did you decide to help us? I told you. I'm expecting a ride on that boat once that hillbilly friend of yours has got it running. You sure that's all of it? You want to keep interrogating me? Or do you want to get the damn battery and get out of here? I'm going to have a look around. You do. I, I do want to keep interrogating you, actually. I'm genuinely interested in hearing your story. Apologies for caring about what women like have to say, I guess. With the lift hydraulics. Fuck. More of Crawford's rules. How did anybody live like this? I'd rather take my chances on the outside. Yeah, well, there was a fascist, bro. It's locked. No way in. Oh, I'm so worried about this fucking car. I can't reach it up there. I'm going to put it down and it's going to start blinking, dude. No power. Wait. Don't think I can pry that hose apart with just my hands. Maybe if I had something to cut it with. Bro, there's not anything else going on here. What the fuck am I supposed to do? You got a fucking knife in that backpack? Something you need? Think I can borrow that uh, hook thing of yours? I don't know. Hilda and I have been through a lot together. Hilda? That's what I call her. Don't judge. Please, can I borrow Hilda? I'll take good care of her. She won't get a scratch. I got your promise now. Not a scratch. I did it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. 
I fucking called That's it. That's probably not good. No shit! I'll try to hold him off. Hurry! There's the battery. Finally something goes right. Is negative first or positive first? That doesn't matter, right? Still attached to the terminals. Got that one off. It's off. Got it. Yeah, but we still got a problem here. Put it in here. I'll carry it. Okay, follow me. Bro, ain't no fucking way. Move your ass. Look at the Confederate flag. Great. Now what? Skylight. It's shut. Shoot it out. You're gonna leave me down here by myself. This ice pick shit is insane. Bro. It took down Trotsky. You know what I mean? Think about that. The It can take out political dissidents and shit. You know what I mean? Ever stop complaining? Come on. Whoa, come, how am I gonna do that? Come on, what are you, chicken? Jump! I don't know, man. That's crazy. Come on. She's, later. She is something I gotta do first. What? She's ten times Catch the man Kenny never was, the by the way. Yeah, I think I'll hold on to it. Make sure you don't leave without me. See you back in class. Molly! God damn it, what the hell is she doing? Every single time Kenny has tried to hold me up like that, he's failed. Every single time Molly's done it. Oh my god, I thought that was Zombers. Do you guys need any help? Thanks, but I think we're almost in. We're taking care of it, Lee. Don't worry. Can't open it without the combination. I bet I can find the combo here somewhere. Five and each other just yet. Let's get the hell back to the classroom. Give us a hand with these fuel cans. They weigh a goddamn ton. And they're the strongest zombies too, because like they were genetically they did some eugenics, you know what I mean? You're back. Yeah, and we made out pretty good too. Great work, Kenny. How you doing with that door? Not so good. Here, let me give you a hand. Did you get that battery yet? Yeah, Molly has it. 
She should be back here soon. She'd better be. Bree? Hey, Lee. Thanks for all your help back there. I don't think we would have made it without you. No problem. We're all on the same team. So you're a cancer survivor, like Vernon and the others. Yeah. We've been had you behind us, so silly at hers. I know. They need to put like treatment ever since. Just when I was starting. The fact that they don't there's like wood panels everywhere. Take out the fucking hatchet and put a goddamn wood panel or a steel pipe in its place. What the fuck are we doing here? When they get better, when I thought there might be some hope. All this happened. Lost my whole family. I'm the only one who survived. Funny how things work out, huh? We could literally she gotta save the hostages, uh, Ribbon. Um <laughs> She we we literally use the hash to break that fucking door down that Ben is unable to open. How long have you known Vernon? Couple of years. He ran our support group. He was really great helping me come to terms with my disease. But how do you come to terms with something like this? With a place like Crawford? I don't know what I or, or the other survivors would have done without Vernon. He's the one who held us together, kept us alive. What do you think about this whole Crawford situation? Sexo? No, dude. Come on. Too many awful memories. Even being back here gives me a bad feeling. Even now, with everyone dead? I got no sympathy for what happened to these people. They weeded out the sick and the old, even children, those least able to defend themselves so that they could save their own skins. Whatever happened here, however Crawford fell, I consider it poetic justice. Damn, girl, that's cold. It's how I feel. If you'd seen what I seen, you'd feel the same. I'm a little busy here, Lee. Maybe you should go get that battery or help with the medicine. Okay. You just used me like a cum rag. She just trauma dumped on me and then fucking was like, all right, get the fuck out of here. Leave me alone. Okay, Clem. Yeah. This desk is just like the ones we have in my school. I know it's weird, but I kind of miss it being in school. Me too. I used to be a teacher, remember? Tell you what, when we find ourselves a safe place, set up a little classroom, just you and me. Will there be homework? No homework. Where's There's an mom? allegory that schools Can't fascism. Here. She'll be back soon. Allegory that schools or prisons. She's okay. She'll be fine. She's pretty tough. Do you Panopticon. think things will ever be normal again? Just like the way they were before. The word? I don't know if that's the right word. I forgot what she said. Yeah. It may take a while, but yeah, I do. Don't you? I hope so. That's good. You hold on to that hope. It's the one thing none of this can take away. Dude. What do we still need? We already got the fuel and the battery. Once we find some medicine, we'll be good to go. So where's this battery you found? Molly has it. She ran off to do something. Well, she'd better bring it back here. I don't know why you trusted that girl with it. We hardly know her. She, she saved, saved my life. life, didn't she? She saved my life more times yeah. than you did, bitch ass. She saved my life in like the identical scenarios where you have failed, okay? Multiple times. Molly, in my opinion, Molly, in my opinion, is on is is good in my book. She's a okay. Is it effing a little bit? What's happening? It's not effing on my end. The hell's going on? Only good thing Kenny did was fuck up in defending me and not shoot Molly. Yeah, but what has she done for me lately? No, wait. There is something you can help me with. Something that's been on my mind. I could use your opinion. What is it? It's Kenny. Since I've been helping him work on the boat, I've gotten to know him a little better. 
He's a good guy, you know? And it's eating me up knowing what I know. I've oh my god. Him the truth. Ben, come on. This again? It's my fault Duck and Katja got killed. If I hadn't screwed up back at the motor inn, they'd still be alive. How am I supposed to just carry something? Bro, he's just yelling right behind him. And it's crazy because it's like, dude. Dude. You haven't brought anything to the table. Since you got here, you've just fucked up over and over and over again. It's so fucking stupid that you think Kenny's going to have any... Like, you, you haven't built any social capital. Like that around. I have to tell him. Ben, no offense, but have you lost your motherfucking mind? <laughs> Kenny's barely hanging on. You tell him you're to blame? I don't even want to think about what he might do. I know. I've thought about that. But I don't know how much longer I can keep looking him in the eye. I feel like I'm lying to him by not telling I'm him. I'm telling you, man, it's a bad idea. Real, real bad. Hey, maybe you're okay walking around with somebody's blood on your hands, but that's not who I am. Okay, I Ben. Just pretend it never Go happened. tell him. Look, we need Kenny. We need him to hold his shit together if we're ever going to get out of here. Fuck so it, dude. Go tell him. Yourself, for the good of everyone. You hear me? I can't wait to leave him off the boat, dude. It's going to be so sick. You. I'm going to tell Kenny. I'm going to get back to this. I'm going to literally tell Kenny. I'm going to tell I'm going to tell Kenny right as we're about to get on the boat. All right, what the fuck do we do now? Damn, don't you feel kind of bad for Ben? Fuck no. There's a hole? This place definitely has some major damage. Sounds like there's a shit ton of walkers out there. Yeah, it doesn't sound like it. It looks like it too, bro. There's got to be a way to take this fucking pole and put it in its place, dude. Come on. going like I, I just i guess i'm waiting for molly right shit oh fuck kristen vernon must be trapped in there bro i shouldn't be shooting these motherfuckers dude how am i gonna fucking pop them? Thank God I got fucking dead eye up in this bitch, dude. I am so good. Who are you pointing your gun to? What the hell happened? They wandered into the hallway after we got inside. I think they must have heard us rooting around in here. The whole place is infested. They're everywhere. Calm down. I took care of them. What about the meds? Did we find what we need? Yeah, that's our other problem. Take a look. That's, what, that's why they call me the Turkish Tonic. Looks like they were keeping all the prescription meds in that safe, locked up tight. There's no way we can bust it open? Maybe with enough time, but I don't know how much of that we have. Be a hell of a lot quicker if we just knew the four-digit combination. Ain't nobody saying that? Dude, everyone is calling me that. That's crazy that you fine. said that. We should just try busting it open. We don't have any other choice. Okay, you get started. I'll take a look around, see if I can find anything useful. To take time to rest later, I think. Come on, bro. There's got to be some notes. Machine. Not that it matters with no power around here. Just a bunch of papers. Oh, no fuck. combination, though. Well, that was my. That was it for me. Not working. Huh. 
<laughs> That's it, bro. I try my best, okay? Phones probably haven't worked in months. Looks like some kind of medical file. It's probably Molly's. Anna Correa. Guess she must have been a patient here. And what's this? How's it coming? Slow. Too slow. I'm worried <coughs> that by the time we manage to get this thing open, it may be too late. Molly helped me get the battery we needed. That's great. One down. Where is she? She took off. Had some kind of errand she needed to run. Took off? With the battery? Yeah. Don't worry. She'll be back. I hope so. That girl doesn't really strike me as a team player. More the mercenary kind. How much time do you think Omid has, Doc? You want my medical opinion? The sooner we get him some strong antibiotics to start fighting that infection, the better. Let's just leave it at that, huh? Hey, Doc, uh, I just wanted to thank you for coming with us and for all your help. I really appreciate it. Bro, imagine she takes the battery to the times boat like these, we've and just fucking leaves with the, the boat. Most, right? And we're no better than those Crawford sons of bitches. I heard that. I'll go see if I can find something that'll help us get that safe open. I know she doesn't have Good the idea. gas, but she's resourceful, you know what I mean? Uh, how much you want to bet the clock stopped ticking? And it's the, whatever the clock number is, that is actually the... That is actually the code. But, uh, but it's in between fucking one and two, so I don't even know. Nah, that'd be too easy. I don't think that's it, but... Wait, what the hell? No tape inside. Vernon, Krista, come look at this. This is day 82 since the outbreak. 1547, Dr. Logan in consultation with patient Anna Correa. Why are you recording this? Oh, he's the rapist. Oberson has ordered me to keep records of all medical examinations. He's a rapist doctor. I need you to brace yourself, Anna. The sonogram confirms that you're pregnant. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. As you know, the rules are very clear. The termination is mandatory. You don't have to tell them. Tell them it was just nausea. But you gave me something for it and it went away. This is my problem, not yours. If Oberson finds out that I could see old evidence of a pregnancy, I'm sorry, but the He's an abortion doctor. Oh my god. The doctor's a Democrat. Oh my god, this is the future liberals want, bro. This is literally this is it. This is full tilt fascism. This is Joe Brandon's America. Oh my god. That's why Molly killed him. These are the rules. I'm gonna give you a sedative. It'll make the procedure easier on you. Wait, what is it? I don't want the Fuck. My baby! I can't do this! I can't do this! Shut up, dumbass! Yeah, you don't have a choice. Let him hit the numbers! Now, if you like, you can take some time with this. But I need you to come back no later than tomorrow. Or I'll have no choice but to inform Oberson myself. I'm sorry. Oh my god, you're so stupid. You're so stupid. Bro. Bro, we were so close, dude. Damn it. We almost had it. What the hell kind of place was this? Like Molly said, the worst kind. Lee, maybe there's another tape. We gotta keep looking. I think I recognize that doctor. He was am one I of the crazy? walkers out in the alley by the <laughs> auto Okay, am I actually crazy? Or is that the only valid protocol that they were that they had, which was like forcing an abortion? Cause like yeah, the killing of the children stuff is crazy, but it's like, yeah, bro, you probably should fucking not have a child in the middle of a zombie apocalypse, you know what I mean? The fuck? Especially in that circumstance? I don't know. Why the fuck do you want to bring a child to a zombie apocalypse? That is low-key. Oh my god, I'm agreeing with the Joe Brandon fascist, dude. Oh my God, that's it. That's, that's why I'm a Democrat.
That's why I'm a god dang Democrat, folks. You already know. You already know, baby. That's why I enforce the abortion of the top of the hour ad break to you. An actual abortion. But if you want to abort the top of the hour ad break, all you need to do is subscribe, baby, for $5 or for free. You can use the baby as a distraction while you run away. Very confused, MB. Thank you for the 10 tier one gifted subs. Allowing 10 people to no longer see the ads at the top of the hour, allowing them to abort their own fucking babies. Cutie Hassan Rella. Thank you for the five. What a username. Thank you for the five. Get this us. Here's the thermometer right now. Maybe you should search it. See what he's got on him. Oh, fuck. I can't go back out there. There's a hell of zombies out there. Watch tape? Yeah, no. I'm good, son. What's this on the floor? It's a sonogram. There's dried blood on this printout. And on the floor. Looks like a trail of it from the safe to the camera over there. Then out the door. What the hell happened here? Y'all already checked these drawers? Yes, Lee. Nothing in there worth taking. Uh, already cleaned out. Looks pretty sturdy. <laughs> Shoot it. We're gonna force that open. We might be able to find something to pry it open, but it'll take time. We don't have time. Omid needs that medicine. We have to get it open now. Hey, Krista. Yeah? I hope I did the right thing bringing Clementine with us. This place isn't exactly safe. Then why did you? Because leaving her alone with Omi didn't seem any safer. What's that supposed to mean? No it means your man's about to die. Omid's pretty sick. If he dies with Clementine alone in the house with that him... That is not going to happen. Do you hear me? That is not going to happen. We're going to get these meds to Omid, and he's going to be fine. He's going to be fine. You're right. I'm sorry. Dude, everyone is on the, uh, on the Lulu levels. The safe? No. Without the combination, I don't know how we're going to get this damn thing open. If we don't get back to Omid with some medicine soon... It's okay. We'll figure it out. Are you feeling okay? I'm fine. Why are you asking me that? It's just that you've been looking a little pale the past couple of days. You've been throwing up. Oh, you... come on. You just dug up a rotting dog carcass. I'm surprised we weren't all throwing Bro, up. he's about to pull the fucking... I'm fine. Quit... He's about to pull the Brandon's American Democrat move and get her to abort the baby that she's Worry definitely about, carrying. Okay? Worry about Omid. We've got to get him these meds. Look, he's preggers, too. I just want to get back to Omid. Let me do my thing, all right? Okay. She pregante, dude. She's freaking pregante, brother. Wait, can I take the camera? Oh, no, you can't. Look at this fucking zombie bloodbath that I just engaged in. What is that noise? How the fuck am I going to get back? There's hella zombies in there too, no? Oh my god, oh my god, bro. Kick him in the fucking head. Oh shit. The shelf is definitely breaking. Like 100 P this time. Okay, still not breaking. 
Where the hell did he go? Oh, I'm so scared. This is definitely the guy. Bro has two and fours? What does that mean? Yeah, how about you get a Bordeaux? Dumbass. How do you like it? This might be just what we need. No. What's this? Looks like some kind of code. But Vernon said the safe combination. Oh, that's was for only the fucking hours. bloody hand thing. Shit, time to go. How am I going to get back? I just skedaddled on back. Wait, are there more zombers? Logan. This must have been his locker. Wait. Another tape. Safe combination has got to be on one of these. Tune fours when you can call surroundings the exhibit cartoon like physics. Two more oh. tapes. One of them is dated October 10th. That's the day after the first one we watched. Put it in. Have you made a decision? I thought you said I didn't have a choice. Well, technically you do. You can terminate the pregnancy or leave Crawford. Of course, that would be a death sentence for both you and your unborn child. Maybe that's best. I stayed up all last night thinking about this. Bro, Why that's crazy. are we crazy. even trying to survive? To keep on living, if this is what it takes. If this is what it's turned us into. That's crazy. I'll the rules, Anna. Doctor, I'm begging you. Please help me. Maybe one day when things are different. Bro, I really thought this doctor was a rapist. Turns out he's just doing abortions. Like... <laughs> <laughs> That's the evil villain in Molly's world. What the hell's going on? Okay, don't we're spoil it, obviously. Again, but for now, today, we have to do this. Okay, what's the code? Bitch ass. Seven, two, fuck! <laughs> Bro. No. Are you for fucking no. real? Be for fucking real. What the hell is the code? I didn't even get to see it. I think we know what happened to Crawford. More importantly, we got the combination. Why is she crying? Because she pregante herself, bro. That's why. Krista, are you all right? What's wrong? It's nothing. That was just hard to watch. No more. She about fucking. It. I'm fine. Bro. She tiller tiller baby killered her, by the way. That's literally it was almost a woman moment. <laughs> she straight up, she straight up was like, oh yeah, you're an abortion doctor. Guess what, dude? Here, abort yourself, okay? Fucking Bill O'Reilly stand out here. Fucking moms for America looking ass. That's crazy. Also, if you're going to leave, why, why, why wouldn't you just voluntarily leave? What the fuck? Why'd you have to stab the dude and fucking grab his gun and shit? All right. Let's get those meds and get the hell out of here. That was not the code at all that We're he was... In business. Antibiotics, morphine. We'll take as much of this as we can carry. That literally was not the code that okay, the doctor was putting in. Good. This is more than enough for your people and mine. Let's go. What do you mean your people, bro? I tape in the locker outside. Maybe there's something else on there. We got the meds for Omid. That's all I care about. Yeah, it's we'll going to be Molly, and I want to see it. Don't take too long, Lee. <laughs> Pro-life my ass, bro. Oh, he is a rapist. 
Listen, as fun as this was, I have to put a stop to this little arrangement. This is the last I can give you. Why? Oberson had someone down here yesterday taking inventory. He's really cracking down. I just can't risk it. We had a deal. Yes, we had a deal. We don't anymore. Bro, she My looks young as hell. This medicine. Without it, she'll die or she'll start showing symptoms and they'll take her away. I can't let that happen. I'm sorry, Molly. I've done all I can, but I have to look out for myself here. Yeah, that's the Crawford way, isn't it? Why does she actually... Why did he film him zipping his zipper up? Oh my God, Chad is right. He's engaging in a problematic age gap sexual relationship with a power dynamic. Dude, dude, that is the worst crime of all. That was like the OJ's worst crime. Problematic, problematic age gap. Oh my God. Oh, he's so, he deserved it. He deserved me kicking his head in for sure. Well, shit. Anything else that we might have missed over here or what? Vernon and Krista already took everything we need. You never know, bro. Oh, God, it's going to be full of zombies in the fucking hallway, I bet. Oh, God, it's not showing. Is them close angles? Jesus Christ. Oh, shit. Oh, you scared the shit out of me. Fuck you, what Molly, fuck you been? fucking I asshole, see. bro. I'll take that battery now. Oh, yeah. Uh, about that. What? I'm just kidding. Here you go. Such a fun little prank, Molly. What's that? Nothing. You can quit with the act, Molly. I know you're from Crawford. What? Who told you that? I saw you on a security tape. Why'd you lie to me? Security tape. I said there tape. were stories about Crawford. I never said that's how I knew about it. I never lied to you, and even if I did, so what? I don't owe you anything. You saved my life twice, but you can't tell me the truth. Are we really good? Bro, he, he put he put the he put the battery in his prison pocket. Chat, chill. Then do this now. I guess that's up to you. I used to live here with my sister. She was fourteen years old. When the dead started walking and Crawford shut itself in, it seemed like a pretty good deal at first. We were safe. We had everything we needed to survive. Then the rules started coming down. No one who couldn't justify their place, earn their keep. No one who required special care. My sister was diabetic, and by Crawford's rules, that made her a liability. That's crazy that they, they're clapping diabetics out here. Safe for as long as I could, but in the end, I couldn't protect her. That's when I got out. Crawford, they always talked about how their system worked. How anything was better than becoming one of them. But I saw what they'd already become. I just wish I could have seen it before it was too late. Before they came and took my sister away. I mean, it's not that this different than... All I have left of her. It's not that different than America, honestly. <laughs> Situation is dire. I didn't have time to take it before I got out of Crawford. I just wanted it, okay? It's okay, Molly. I understand. She's pretty. What the hell? I think that's our cue to get the hell out of here. Who's ringing them bells? What? Bro, I had like three revolvers, by the way. Why didn't I get one? Oh, oh, shit. oh my yeah. God, Ben, sorry, you fucking sorry. suck ass. I just ass. got spooked by those bells, and then I heard someone coming. Did you leave Clementine alone? No, Kenny's with her. We still can't open that armory door. He sent me out to look for something we can use to bust it open. I found this. Uh, he did ben? not. Where did bro. You get that? Bro. Just found it. It was stuck in the door handle at the end bro. of the- Bro, bro, I should have fucking, I should have told him to tell Kenny. 
I should have told him to tell Kenny. I should have told him to tell Kenny. I should have told him to tell Kenny so Kenny could kill him. I should have told him to tell Kenny so Kenny would have fucking killed him. God damn it, he's such a stupid fucking asshole. Oh my god, Ben, you have to die. You have to die. I hope you die right here. Oh my god, you are such a fucking asshole, dude. Fuck you, dude. Oh my god, I want to fucking string him from a goddamn rope and dangle his ass. What is, is it effing? It's not effing on my end. It's like a server side issue, I think. It was small. Okay. Man, I'm so fucking mad. I'm I'm actually pissed. Hallway back there. Oh no. Ah, shit. Who, who shot him? I didn't shoot him. It wasn't me. Good going, kid. Nice shot. Thanks. Oh my god. That was awesome. What the fuck is going on? They're coming. Oh shit. That ought to hold them. Sir, but now how do we get out? Through the armory. We can just get this damn door open. Come on, damn you! I'm just gonna use the hatchet. This is my fault, all my fault. <laughs> the hell's he babbling about? Ben, we talked about this. No, wait. I want to know what he meant. What do you mean this is all your fault? Kenny, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, man. Kid, this ain't the best time. Whatever you did, save it for later. I, I, I buckled. Go ahead, tell him. It's been me all along, putting all of us... I'm sorry, I hope he dies. I hope, I hope Kenneth kills him right now. I, it probably is a fucked up... It's probably fuck it's probably gonna fuck it up. I'm weak. I'm a weak man. I'm a weak man. I told him to in tell danger. him. Gotcha and duck. It was all me. It was all me. Wait a minute. What are you saying? It was me who made the deal with the bandits at the motor inn, slipping them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep them off our backs. When it got discovered, that's when they attacked. And that's when Duck. <laughs> Kenny man, I agree with you. You should kick his ass. But now's not the time. I gotta focus on getting out of here. <laughs> you little piss ant! You're fucking dead, you hear me? Dad! My wife and child! You gotta both fucking kill! Kenny, listen to me. You can whip his skinny little ass. Dude, Ben's survival instincts are so bad. He's just a liability. Yeah, he's just a liability. He literally is a walking, talking liability. We need to use him to lure the fucking zombies away. That's it. That's the only thing he's good for. Fucking leech ass, worm ass, piece of shit, skinny ass, fucking bandito loving, dumb fuck, taking the hatchet. I found a hatchet. I wonder what the fucking hatchet was there for. You didn't find the hatchet, Ben. You fucking took it from a goddamn door with zombies behind it. Later, but right now we gotta go. Nice group you got here. Not the time, Molly. If this asshole thinks he's getting on my boat after what he did, he's out of his motherfucking mind. Kenny, we'll sort this out later. After we get out of here, okay? Ain't nothing to sort out. I just told you the way it's gonna be. The boat's not big enough for all of us. Somebody's gotta get left behind. Might as well be this piece of shit right here. Well, I vote we leave him. I'm sorry, Ben. <laughs> I know you mean well. Bro, she's new. I bro, bro, she ain't even... She's new here. Yo, even the new girl's like, yeah, no, you fucking suck, dude, honestly. <laughs> you haven't even harmed me beyond the whole zombies attacking us thing but she's like nah we leave his ass you fuck him get back to omid and you put that at risk wait don't i get a vote of course you do clem's like yeah it's nice he's my friend we don't leave friends behind 
That's my vote. On second thought, I think I'm gonna abstain. Lee? Fuck. I can't do this right now. I abstain. We'll figure this out later. I'm a coward. What I'm not. about the rest of us? Don't we get a say? Ah! Nope, you don't get a say, lady. You're dead. More dead than the cancer, too. Free. Now can we go? Damn right. Vernon, come on. <laughs> Bro, we didn't even give a fuck about Bree. Lee literally turned around and was like, damn right, let's get out of here. It's time. That's awesome. Okay, we couldn't even open a fucking armory door and now it's not closing. How is that possible? So much for the armory. What's left of it? A few rounds. That's it. You didn't close that door behind us? I couldn't. The lock was busted. Great. Just fucking great. Come on. There's got to be a way out down here. Oh, close the back. Fuck! That's not gonna hold. Back upstairs! Is that a zombie? Lee, look! What the fuck? How many fucking bows do I have? Thank God I have fucking perma bullets up in this bitch, huh? Is that a child? What the fuck? Where is it? Oh, fuck! Oh, oh, he's eating my dick, bro. Oh, he's eating my dick. Oh my God. Did it F again? Where the fuck? What the fuck? Where'd they come from? Dude, easy peasy, bro. It ain't nothing to me. It ain't a big deal. It ain't a fucking big deal at all. I'm lobbing them. Wait, what the fuck? Yo, this is light work, baby. Light work. Oh no, I lost the hatchet. I should have grabbed the hatchet. Fuck. Come on. It's all right. I'm fine. Any way out of here? This leads to the roof. We might be able to find a way down from there. You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? Yeah. Why? Never mind. I can see the sewer where we came in from here. I think we can do this. Well, what are we waiting for? Go, what do you mean go! You didn't come from the railroad. What the fuck? Why did he say that? Why the hell did he say that? Yeah, come on, let's go. <laughs> what is happening? <laughs> I kind of want to. Uh, Hold on, Ben. I kind of want to let him die, but I want to also dangle him. Ben, uh, climb up! Come on, you can do it. He's gonna die. There's no time. You have to go now. Quit fucking around, Ben. Come on. Let go, damn it! Get Clem and the others out of here. Lee. like you know what to do you know what to do let him go bro we both know let him go 
Oh, sweet release, baby. Let me go. Sweet release. Let him go. Let his ass go, bro. You're gonna die. Come on, bro. Get the fuck out of here. R.I.P. Bozo. Ain't no fucking way. Yeah, eat his ass. Fucking piece of shit. I'm willing to bet, even if I didn't let him go, he still would have fucking fell, okay? It doesn't matter. <laughs> that was your fastest QTE? I didn't even think. Krista? Everything okay? Oh, me! Oh, he's not there? Bro, he's gonna turn somber? Krista, don't! Stay back! I never should have left you. I'm so sorry. Krista, get away from him. Oh, wait, he's alive. Oh, my God. Hey. Back already? <laughs> Omid is kind of dope, dude. He's so weird. He's like... He's just... <laughs> I like Omid. Omid is like Ben, but actually funny and useful. And he also has a funny-ass Riz face every time. He's always like... Mm. We got you medicine. Good. Feel like I could use some. Where's Ben? He didn't make it. What happened? Dumb son of a bitch nearly got us all killed. Lee stepped up and did what he had to. That's what do you mean Lee stepped happened. up and did what he had to? What the fuck does that mean, asshole? Don't say that. Nice going, asshole. What's eating you? Yeah, I did what I had to. But I don't expect Clementine to understand Kenny, that. you fucking suck, dude. You're such a fucking asshole, Kenny. Dumb, boat-loving son of a bitch. Do you ever think about anything in front of Clem? Fuck. Hell, I don't want her to understand it. You did the right thing. Trust me. She'll understand. I'm gonna go start work on the boat. I didn't drop him. Kenny couldn't okay. see from that angle if I dropped him or not. What the fuck do you mean? A little luck, you should start feeling better pretty soon. I'll stay here for a few more hours to check on him. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks, Doc. Yes, thank you so much. Maybe now's a good time for you and me to have a little talk in private. Listen, man, about what happened to Bree. Please, save your sympathy for someone who's buying it. What? Yeah, he's right. We fucking turned around like you it was no... think by now I got you figured? You don't strike me as someone who has a lot of consideration for others. He's right. Look at what you did to get me to come here with you in the first place. You expect me to believe you give a shit that it wound up costing Bree her life? Now, just hold on a damn minute. Listen. No, you listen. You got some good people here, and they look to you as their leader. Well, I'm here to tell you, the kind of leader you are, they're not going to make it much longer. Oh, my God. Kidding yourself if you think putting them all on a boat is going to solve anything. Wait, why is he reading me to filth? I haven't actually been that bad around Vernon, have I? Is it because of Ben? Is, he be is that why he's mad? Like, I don't get it. Or is he being racist? Is this racially motivated? Now, you may not care about all of those people. But I know you care about that little girl, which is why I'm going to make you an offer. What kind of an offer? Well, I'll take her off your hands, take her back with me to my people. We're well supplied, well hidden, and a lot of us have had kids of our own. And now Crawford's fallen, we got nothing left to fear from them. She'll be safe with us. Safer than she will be if she stays with you. I promise you. I'm That's not going to give her. That's what you want for her, isn't it? To be safe? You're coming at me with a lot here, Vernon. I need to think it over. Of course. Take your time. But I want you to think about some things. Why would you say you'd think about it? You chose to let that boy die back in Crawford. 
I gotta wonder about the morality. Oh my god, bro. What is everyone is making a big deal about Ben falling? Like, I barely I couldn't have saved him anyway. That's crazy. Bro, you don't understand. We got history. First of all, Ben's the reason why Bree died, you dumbass. Oh my god, dude. I had a weak ass grip. Dude, this guy is crazy. Why is everybody being annoying about this whole Ben situation? Am I am I in the wrong? You could have saved Ben Lamau. Wait, really? Something like that. I got to wonder what kind of parent you'd be. Ben's kind of fucking us up. Even even in death, he's still. God, he's such a liability. He really is. He's just like. There is no way. Ben's a Go curse, bro. He would have fucking been so much worse. Yeah, I'm about to head out. I, I just wanted to say thanks for everything. It's been fun. What are you talking about? Kenny's working on the boat right now. Oh, she's like, you killed Ben. I don't want to be with you no more. Everybody's like, everybody's acting brand new since I couldn't pick Ben up. Like, my bad. You were coming with us. God knows you earned it. Yeah, I've been thinking it over. It's not for me. Sounds like it'd be pretty crowded. Oh, my and God. I never did like the water. Bro, that's cr Okay. Uh, 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 what is this? Uh, uh, place. Better not. <laughs> Bro's ops like 16. Dude, he. Dude, what is happening? Bro. Bro, this kid's ruining my life. He's killed so many people. Like, his death is now causing me to lose gang members. What the fuck, dude? Why is everybody acting like Ben was the glue that held everything together? Fuck. <laughs> Making me lose my mind. You sure about this? I'm sure. I've always done better on my own anyhow. Listen, I'm not much for goodbyes. Tell the others for me. Sure. You take care of yourself, Molly. You too, Lee. Bro, we just lost Molly, who's goaded, athletic, resourceful. Sure we lost the doctor. You know she thinks the world of you. Good luck. <laughs> it nothing to do with luck. I'm genuinely bummed. I, it's like actually fucking my vibes up. You hope the races and then kill the teenager. Hey, sweet pea. Kenny's working on the boat. Fucking Clementine hates me. What are we going to do after he fixes it? Where will we go? Someplace else. Someplace better. Clem, honey, what's wrong? What happened, Fuck. Ben? What did Kenny mean when he said you did what you had to? It won't do any good to dwell on it, Clementine. I want to know what happened. Ben was my friend. I liked him. Why? I, him, I did too. And maybe I could have done more to save him. But I had to think about the whole group. Not just one person. But I'm just one person. Not to me, you're not. Before we leave tomorrow, will we have time to look for my parents? I'd like to, Clem. But I don't think we'll have time. We really shouldn't stay here any longer. It's not safe. I'm sorry, Clementine. I'm so sorry.
Bro, your parents are dead. Give it up. I'm your dad now. What the fuck? Am I bad? Am I a bad dad? I've been a good dad. I've been such a good dad so far. Please. No, don't leave the walkie-talkie there. Oh, dude, the fucking pedo is going to be on the call being like, oh, Clementine. Clementine? No, the walkie's gone. Oh, my Lord. Oh, Clementine. my life, dude. This is the worst. Oh my God. I'm going to lose it. I'm going to lose it. I'm going to lose it. I'm going to fucking lose it, dude. Here we go. Did everybody leave me? Wait, what? Bad ending. Everybody left me. Clementine. Clementine. Oh, fuck. Oh, no, dude. No fucking way. Ain't no way. No, 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 no. This is all fucked up. The Ben curse. Oh, no, the Benimal. Clem? Did he eat me? Oh no, I got it. I, I started hitting Q immediately. Like I, I didn't even, I didn't even realize it was a click. Uh oh, someone's taking advantage of my moment of weakness here. Kaya, place. Kai, no. No. Place. No. No. Wait, did I get bit? No. Oh, fuck. Lee. Lee. You out here? Lee! Are you crazy? What are you doing out here? It ain't safe. I'm Lee? gonna show him the bike. Where's Clementine? She's not in her room. Vernon ain't it's in the over. house It's over. I'm either. killing myself. What the hell is going on? Whose blood is that? It's mine. Oh my god. No way. No. No fucking way. There's no time to worry about me. Clementine's gone. There's no chance she just wandered off on her own? No. No way. Then who the hell took her? I don't know. Last night, Vernon came to me and offered to take her with him. Said she'd be better. I'm so mad. Better off. Son of a bitch. I knew we couldn't trust that fucker. Wherever she is, I have to find her. Okay. What do you need from us? Clem may not have much time. We have a better chance of finding her if we all go together. Fuck. Who's with me? We're all responsible for Clementine. And in your condition, you may not make it to her in time. She needs our help. All of our help. Damn right. We can't let you do this alone. So that's settled then. We'll look for Clementine together. Hell yeah. What are we waiting for? Are you sure about this? Could be dangerous. As opposed to what? Day-to-day -day life these days? We're sure, Lee. Just lead the way. Bro, there is no fucking way. Ben's divine retribution is killing me, dude. Me, Lee. Always had my back when it mattered. What kind of friend would I be if I wasn't there for you now? Bitten or not, I'm with you to the end. Bro. You can count on me. This game is fucked up. I feel like I actually got bit in real life. Like, my whole body is warm right now. I'm not even... Maybe I'm being a little too dramatic. But, like, I'm actually in a bad mood now. This game fucked me up, dude. This is not allowed. This is genuinely fucked up. We have to save Clementine and fucking... Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, my God. This sucks so bad. This is a fucked up ass game, dude. Okay, guys, we should go find Vernon. See if he took her. Let's head out. What about the boat? We just gonna leave it unguarded? 
If someone was gonna take Kenny, it, I will fucking end your life, you boat loving piece of shit. Shut the fuck up about the boat. I swear to God, I will blow up the boat. I swear to God, I will take the battery and shove it in a zombie. Okay. Oh my God. What about the boat? Shut the fuck up. My daughter is missing. I'm bit. Besides, I'm gonna die. Fuck, man. Fuck you and your boat. Are they gone? Could have had Ben and Molly on my team. No bite. Clementine not gone. Worst ending of Looks all like they time. Got out of here. I don't understand how there's a fifth episode after this, by the way. I'm dead. Hurry. Vernon. Get out here! There doesn't have to be any trouble here. All I want is the girl. Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt. He's not there, bro. Fucking Vernon, dude. What the hell's going on? Where are they going? Right. Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch. Hello, Lee. Who is this? It's not Vernon, if that's what you're thinking. And you should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine. But if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. Bro, who's doing saw style traps in like the middle of a zombie apocalypse? Like, you're really trying to be mischievous right now, bro? Really? Like, this is the time for mischief? Like, you couldn't be like a whimsical pedophile on any other time that you're just like, nope, this is it. This is the moment. I found my opportunity and I locked it down, dude. Get a better hobby, bro. What the fuck? Come on, kill yourself. That's crazy. That's cr Oh my God. Did you kill the boy in the attic? 25% of players killed him. Oh my God. Wait. Only 25% of players killed the boy? Did you lie or threaten Vernon? You and 42% of players threatened or lied to him. Home alone. Did you bring Clementine with you to Crawford? 55% brought her. For whom the bell tolls? Did you let Ben fall to his death? 47% of players let him go. Only 47? Most save Ben? How? Did you reveal the bite to the group? Yeah, I did. And so did 82% of players. Because at that point, they're like, GG's. It's fucking GG no re. Who came with you? 13% of players. No Ben. 16% had Ben. 18% only Kenny? What the fuck? Came with me where? Who 
the fuck is the 10% that's with just Ben, bro? Who the fuck? Who the fuck did the only Ben run? That makes no damn sense, bro. Who, how? You have to be a real sick fuck to be like, I'm going after, I'm going after Clementine with just Ben. It's just me and Ben. The best ending because you killed Ben and no one knows how it happened. Okay, honestly, these are the poll results in 2012, by the, the way. The boy in the attic. Did you kill the boy in the attic? Uh, yeah. Why wouldn't you kill him? Did you lie? 79% or- killed the boy in the attic. Or threatened Burnham. You, I threatened to lie. What? I didn't mean to do it. Did you bring... Yeah, he probably did the same thing I did, which is... After you save him, he gets positive and tries to help you. Oh, really? That's when... That's when the fucking turn happens? Like, oh, I'm sorry, I couldn't wait. I'm sorry, I couldn't wait for the turn, chat. Did you bring Clementine with you to Crawford? 78% brought her. Did you let Ben fall to his death? You and 62% pulled him up? Bring Clementine with you. 62% pulled him up? Wait. At that point, it was what? There was still a solid 10% Ben only run, which is fucking stupid. Wait, those numbers haven't changed. Really? All right, so. What? Fucking Kevin gave up on me. All right, bro. Wait, how did he leave? How did he lose Kenny? What is this? Grandma doesn't come out of the cage if Hassan doesn't play episode five tonight. Yeah, well, grandma's fucking locked up then. Pack watch for grandma. Because let's be real, I'm done for the night, okay? There ain't no fucking way I'm playing another one. I'm, I'm like emotionally distraught. I'm actually fucked up over this goddamn game, bro. This game is fucked up. I can't play more than one episode per night. I'm not going to lie to you. This shit fucks me up, dude. Sorry, Grandma. Pack watch for you. You're still locked up. No, but like, for real, this shit is fucked up.